education is something that means a lot to me mainly because my grandmother who has passed on was a retired educator and my mother is a retired educator i believe what has happened in modern education is that we have seen a great separation between what i call academia which is strictly learning in the classroom and understanding theory and then how we implement what we learn now i consider education in general to be the implementation of what you learn this is the same argument that we saw between booker t washington and w e b du bois early in the twentieth century so i think we've seen a greater separation of that and what i would like to see is a convergence of the two when i would teach my students at shaw university a few years back what i would often tell them at the end of every semester is yes earn your diploma but hustle as if you never earn your diploma take the same intensity take the same focus in life of persons who have never set a foot in the classroom and use that type of intensity along with your diploma use your degree use your expertise use your training in the classroom to augment your drive and your hustle and your focus within society and to that extent i believe there are a lot of ways to market um, certain facets facets of academia that we have not even thought about yet one of the beauties of living in a globalized culture is that there is an increase in ingenuity and productivity now i think the greatest problem is both standardized tests and the way in which we underpay and undervalue teachers is going to be the greatest travesty that we see in our society going forward we do not pay teachers enough we do not pay school administrators enough although many would argue administrators are still doing much better than our teachers but our teachers especially teachers on a middle school level elementary school level are not being paid enough now i know the united states cannot immediately adopt say the type of model that finland has or the type of model that has worked so well throughout the united kingdom but something has to be done because at this point all we are really doing is preparing inmates that's to a great extent what we see happening in our public school system especially in rural areas we are creating inmates we are destroying creativity we are destroying ingenuity we're breaking the spirits we're just destroying the self-esteem of our teachers in the classrooms and as a society if we love and if we celebrated our teachers the same way we do our athletes who educate um, who are educated by our teachers the same way we do actors who on some level have been educated by our teachers the same way we do our politicians who have been educated in law school or educated in undergrad and graduate school by our teachers then we would see our society move forward in the same kinds of ways that we saw our society move forward at the end of the 19th century going into the early 20th century that's my feeling on education.